Good evening and thanks for joining us on this college football Saturday. I'm Karen Lair. Boise State Bronco fans getting into the game day spirit a bit earlier than usual today. The team taking on the San Diego State Aztecs on the blue turf where Boise State fans are leaving a little disappointed tonight. That's where we find six on your side. Steve Dent joining us live with the very latest. Steve. Well, Karen, it ended up being a dis disappointing afternoon for the Broncos, who lost to San Diego State 19 to 13. Uh, the Broncos just never could get anything going offensively. And despite a good performance on defense, spurred by a very rowdy crowd who contributed to several false start penalties, Boise State suffered their first loss in the Mountain West. <laughs> Before Boise State took the field against San Diego State, fans geared up for the big matchup. Amazing, the, the, the community unifies together on the day of a Boise State game. And Boise State doesn't host Saturday day games very often. I love it. I love it. This is when college football should be played, is in the afternoon. Well, as for the game, Boise State took a 7-3 lead following a muff punt when Alexander Madison punched it in for the touchdown. <laughs> However, it was a lackluster first half for the Bronco offense. They turned it over four times, including Brett Rippon's first two interceptions of the year. It's a pretty good defensive struggle, so hopefully uh, Boise State can uh, crack crack it a little bit and get uh, get some offense going. However, the defense kept it close, forcing two turnovers of their own, and Tyler Horton earned the opportunity to sit on the turnover throne. Tyler Horton came up with the ball for the Broncos. Oh, the defense looks great. I mean, they, uh, San Diego State hasn't been able to, to run the ball at all. They've been able to stuff them. Uh, in, uh, Go Bronx! And even though the Broncos trailed 13-7 at the half, fans still had high hopes for a Broncos comeback. Um, I'm expecting the Broncos to come out second half firing, firing all cylinders, come back and win this game. Now, unfortunately, the Broncos weren't able to make that comeback. Oh, the loss drops Boise State to 3-2 and two on the year. They're now 1-1 one and one in Mountain West. Next week, they travel to Nevada to play the Wolf Pack. And in two weeks, they're right back here on the blue as they face Colorado State. Live at Boise State, Steve Dent, 6 on your side. All right. Thank